We're keeping our sights fixed on Singapore for now. Other than factors like distance and diplomatic neutrality, experience is something the island has plenty of. The Lion City is no novice when it comes to hosting international summits. For a look back at the long list of events it successfully hosted, we turn to our Cha Sang Mi. The special moment for world peace is expected to take place next month in Singapore between North Korean leader Kim Jong-un and U.S. President Donald Trump. And this is not the first time a historic international summit has been held in this affluent island nation in Southeast Asia. The first ever meeting between the leaders of China and Taiwan took place in Singapore in November 2015 between Chinese President Xi Jinping and his Taiwanese counterpart Ma ying -jeou. And last year, Joseph Yoon, U.S. Special Representative for North Korea Policy, also traveled to Singapore for the Northeast Asia Cooperation Dialogue, a security meeting aimed at the denuclearization of North Korea. As for why Singapore has been preferred as an international summit venue, experts say that the country has garnered trust around the world for its political and diplomatic neutrality. The Singaporean government, uh, policy-wise, offers a very neutral background to uh, to these kinds of proceedings. Uh, for instance, Singapore doesn't have any particular regional agenda beyond uh, Southeast Asia. Apart from its convenience and accessibility, the neutrality Singapore offers is what makes the country so attractive for both Pyongyang and Washington. The Singaporean government doesn't really have a particular agenda when it comes to North Korea's denuclearization, unlike the South Korea. North Korea also has an embassy in Singapore's business district, making the country a more accessible choice for Pyongyang. Cha Sang-mi, Arirang News.